Hello and welcome back to the Vimmalat interviews. Today we are here with Overflow and we have Adham Naderi and Onni Roiva here with me. Yes, thank you for having us. So, how do you guys are feeling? Well, there's well, not much to be said. We're feeling okay. We're happy to be here. Every day is fine. Mm. Well, that's great to hear. How's the team? Well, it seems good. We're functioning pretty well. Everything, everything is going accordingly. We communicate well. Uh, when when we're working, there's not really much. Uh, we don't really have a feeling there are uh, somebody would be clueless or lost. We always communicate well, so we are aware of where we are as individual and, and as a team. And we knew each other prior to way Malab. So yeah, oh, okay. It well, really that, helps on the communication. That really yeah. helps working together. Yes. Uh, what's your roles? Uh, we're both front-end developers right now. We've actually been doing it for the past three, four weeks. Yeah, I'd say, I'd say more like for the past two weeks because the first week we really didn't do anything. We were introduced with the task and we didn't get to do anything. Then we had the, then we had the open days, which really took a lot of time. We didn't have that much of a chance to do any developing, so we've been doing it for two weeks right now. So you have guys have had a slow slow start, so to say. Well, you could say that. You could say that. Yeah, it's working pretty swiftly now. Yeah. So you all get well together. That's yeah. kind of what you already said because you know each other already. So you have been working on this Vimma forum. What is it? Well. Uh, it's a it's a sort of a website but also a forum where people students or any people that like to communicate with other people could go there and communicate with one another but mostly it is aimed for students so what they talk about there like anything uh, projects and stuff uh, well it could be it could be uh, pretty much anything that they really like to talk about school how should they oh, okay, improve okay. school and stuff like that? Okay, okay. So it has other uses too. It, it has a lot of uses. You can do whatever you want, but mainly yeah. for communication by, about everything. So yeah. how was the development going? Um, Are you getting it ready before autumn, or is it gonna be a problem for the next students? No, it's getting ready, and <laughs> probably we're gonna get. To the point where we're adding our own features too. Oh, yeah. so yeah, that's it's pretty, great. it's pretty swift, swift the development, and um, I think we're all really enjoying it yeah. at the moment. Yeah. Well, that sounds great. Mm. Mm. So, how has the Vimal have been for you? Well, um, it's been enjoyable experience. To be fair, um, when I came here, when I applied to the Vimal Lab. I was uh, I was a bit skeptical that could I do anything there because it wasn't really meant for first year students. But since we are first year students, we applied here. But ever since I've got into the office and I have done, I have been doing this for two weeks. It really has grown on me. It feels really good. I'm enjoying communicating with other people, and um, yeah, it's really good experience, in my opinion. And it, uh, also the fact that it shows you what what type, what the real life work can be. Also at the same time, it's all, not always all about uh, It's not always about coding and stuff. You have to communicate and tell people what you're doing and how you're doing it and how far you've gone. Every day, I'd say we're learning something new, yeah. and every day it's it's fun to come to the office. Yeah. yeah. So you say that your expectations at the start were that. You did hope that it wasn't for the first year students. Yes, that's how I understood it. Yeah, basically, I think we had this kind of mindset that we're not enough, but mm -hmm. as we you were figured, proven wrong. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's great. Yeah. Would you recommend Vimala for further students? Oh yes, definitely. Absolutely. This has been the one course that I learned so much compared to the others. Yeah already at this point. Mm. Uh, thoughts about the visiting companies? I mean, it, it's something, it's really, 
good in my opinion. You get to see the different aspects of ICT that it's it's not always all about coding. There's so much more to it that, and there's so many different branches where you could go towards. It's not always all about you know uh, coding and stuff like that. There's more to it that it's not just that. And the fact that we've had these presentations to prove and show that it is something really enjoyable, and the fact that you get to uh, see other people's from different work it's it's a really enjoyable yeah <laughs> exactly so you like the aspect of networking and uh getting to know these companies at the same time mm. yeah i yeah. think it's a useful thing for us considering the future yeah and not just uh, just uh, in a way just to increase social network it's more like um should you actually run into a certain problems you could ask these people that how how could i perform what things i could do when i come into uh, come across this type of an obstacle problem that how what should i do in that case it's really good that you always have that help yeah, yeah and so google does yeah exactly Very good. Yeah. during the first week we actually asked one of the persons from Nodern that how should we start studying this React. Yeah. Um, so she actually gave us a heads up and everything we should do. Yeah. Well, really nice. So we got inside help. Yeah. 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 Not, not just from uh, the Nodern, I think we got also help from Pinia as well. Mm. Yeah. So it's really good. That's oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, thoughts about the coaches? Mm, I, well, they can't get any better. Yeah, definitely, because every time, uh, if we should run across a problem, there's the support and there's always the help and guidance that how we should do the things. And it's really, uh, it's also the fact that the people, the coaches are really are um, uh, happy people. You, you can talk with them about everything that you want. So it, it also, it also eases you up. You don't have that pressure that how, what should I say and how should I act? You never have that because they're mm. really, really helpful people and enjoyable company. Yeah. yeah. So we return for the general stuff for a while. So if you're cool, what you're saying teams for one day and why? Probably just to know what the other teams are doing because yeah. at the moment I really don't have that much of a clue. For like example, what IoT do is doing. Yeah. Something with plastic skin. Yeah. Yeah, very well. Yeah. Also, yeah, if I could swap, it's probably it's probably Mysticoms because their subject is something that I really like and something that I find very interesting. But just like Oni said, yeah, if if the swap would happen, it's most likely just to see where what they are doing, how they're doing it, and where are they at this moment. That's Bob, but I wouldn't swap because I enjoy my <laughs> position at the, at, the, at the current position. Well, yeah. Many of the other people have said that they will not like to change their teams because they like their own team so much. But the Mysticos has been a favorite so far. Yeah. But all right. This is pretty much it. I thank you guys for joining me. So see you next time. See ya. See you. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you for having us.